Right, and this all happened just after 11 o'clock last night. It was, of course, Valentine's night. An awful lot of passers-by saw the, uh, well, the devastation firsthand. Uh, let me just step out of the shop for a moment so we can get a clearer idea of what happened here. You can see there that silver-coloured saloon car at the side of High Holborn here, parked outside a uh, McDonald's restaurant. Uh, when that masonry from the building to the left of McDonald's came crashing down upon it, an awful lot of wreckage there. This was no small part of stonework which fell upon the car. Uh, a woman, 49 years of age, was in the driver's seat. She was sadly declared dead at the scene by rescue crews. There were another two passengers in the rear of the car, a 25-year-old man and a 24-year-old woman. Uh, she was able to escape by herself, but the 25-year-old man had to be uh, taken out by around 20 firefighters who uh, attended the scene here. He's been treated in hospital for leg injuries. His condition is described as stable. Uh, another uh, passerby was also injured in the uh, in the incident. Uh, you can see the, the just the scale of the dam damage that's been done to the car and all that stonework which is on the ground now around it. Uh, the scene here is still preserved uh, for a health and safety investigation to see if any more light can be shed on exactly how this came to happen.